Come on, film us through the rangefinder. Head 98 meters. There you go. The figure's veering because I'm so shaky. There's some more down here too somewhere. There we go. These are wild, if there's nothing tame about them, just because there's so many, it's just, there's no, uh, if I just show you the fence right here beside the car, if that, you can call that a fence. Is it? But, uh, no, it's not really a fence line. And then over the back there is where I actually shot a deer, um, this last hunting season, just on the wildlife lands there, to try and move forward, I think, because he's going to get in the trees. These trees here. through the with the Bushnell Elite 1500 range finder um, and uh, it's hard to keep it still on them but and I keep the uh, settings set on metric like the meters instead of instead of yards now with this I have actually measured deer out to 670 meters and it has got a rating on deer of about um, about 500 I think and that's in the rifle mode that's better Daddy. Yeah, Daddy. What? Daddy. So you can see they're about 210 meters deer over there, just as if uh, there's no over there, the ones that have jumped the car behind us there have just started hanging out right here, just to give you an idea, this oh, hell. there's more just coming out here too, there's more, heaps more here, there's more just showing up all the time coming out of these trees. The wildlife lands that um, just directly on this opposite thing. I should just go back over there. That's where that um, you see there's uh, a bit of a slough, a bit of a um, peat bog or what do you call it? Swamp down in this gully where these trees are and then cross over. To this uh, flat ground up here, 